began here at 11 o'clock with an exclusive conversation. After nearly six months of no answers, a father is pleading with those of you who live in North Charlotte to help find his daughter's murder. Charlotte Mecklenburg police say in December, 20 year old Sianna Morris was shot and killed. Now in June, no answers, no arrests. And tonight her dad is talking with our Erica Lunsford. Erica joins us now live from CMPD headquarters. Erica, this has to be frustrating for her dad. Yes, Molly, and Sianna Morris would have turned 21 earlier this month on June 2nd. Her father says, you know, he talked about the moments going through this birthday without her here. He says as a dad, you know, he's constantly battling to keep his pain from turning into anger. You know, it's a, it's a tough thing to deal with on a day to day basis. That's how Cecil Morris describes the six months without his daughter, Sianna Morris. Her personality was free spirited and she just wanted to, you know, be a hairstylist. That's all she's ever done since a kid. CMPD says a shooting happened in the 4300 block of Valview Lane near the intersection of Statesville Road and Cindy Lane just before 5 p.m. on December 17th of last year. No arrests have been made. It's just I would think that if an innocent 20 year old girl is murdered in a cul-de-sac in North Charlotte that there will be some type of resolution within six months. In cases like this, we look for everything, ring videos, uh, anybody noticed a car in the area lately, anything, nothing is too small. We checked with Charlotte Mecklenburg Police. As of Friday night, no new updates. Detectives would appreciate anyone who hears this and knows anything to please come forward, if for no other reason than her dad. I want the, the, the presence of this case to be in the forefront of the people's eyes of North Charlotte continuously until we get to the bottom of it. And I don't want it to be forgotten. I don't want people to think that it's done. CMPD says any tip leading up to an arrest in this case could be eligible for up to a $5,000 reward. Reporting in Charlotte, Erica Lunsford, WBTV, on your side. Well, Erica, hopefully this helps. Thank you.